Fox 5 Health News, just how different is the coronavirus from the flu and how concerned should we be? Joining us now is Dr. Jennifer Caudill, a family physician and professor at Rowan University. So good that you're here today. Thank you. Okay, so let's just start first with anybody that doesn't understand what the difference between the flu and the coronavirus is. We'll define the two. So first of all, they're two different viruses. Yeah, okay, yeah. that's the first thing to keep in mind. And they cause two different types of illnesses. Um, and just to go through the numbers, for example, we know that we get millions of cases of the flu every year uh, in this country. About 18,000 deaths have been reported at, so far. In this country right now, we've got um, 200 confirmed cases and around 11 deaths. That's only part of the story, however, I need to caution mm, us. Sure. But just to start, there two totally different things, um, but they're transmitted almost the same way, um, and we need to be cautious in the same ways for both of them. Right, and the thing is we don't have the full extent of the outbreak because we're having a testing shortfall, we don't have enough test kits to figure out how many people have the coronavirus, and that's making it difficult to figure out how much deadlier that's the right. Coronavirus is in the regular flu. That's right. Now we do know that coronavirus, this novel case of the corona, strain of the coronavirus, COVID-19, 80% of cases are mild. Okay, so that's really important to keep in mind. Um, but to your point, we say, well, if that's the case, are we actually even testing everyone? We know that the answer is no. Mm -hmm. We don't have full testing capabilities. We think this virus has been roaming around for a little bit longer than we've started to pick up. Mm -hmm. And as as you mentioned, because of that, when we talk about death rates, for example, we know that the death rate for the flu is about 0.1%. There. Have been been numbers for the death rate for coronavirus. I've seen numbers 1.4%, 2%, 3%. Right, Truth yeah. of the matter is we don't entirely know right now because one of the reasons we don't know fully the scope of cases that have, have been and are the out there. Well, that's right. what I was going to ask you. We don't fully know this either, but uh, what can you tell us about the difference in transmission? Okay, so transmission or symptoms or both or uh, uh, like how it's, how it's what spread? What we know so far, yeah, how yeah. you can get it versus, you know, the flu versus yeah. 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 coronavirus. All right, so let's talk about transmission. Well, just a brief moment about symptoms. So coronavirus, we think of fever, shortness of breath, cough. There are some reports that people get other symptoms like, you know, stuffy nose, runny nose, things like that, cold symptoms. Uh, the flu, uh, my patients tell me, and I've had it before, you feel like you've been hit by a bus. You right. get the, the, yeah. the muscle pains and, and fatigue and, and fever. Stomach, stomach well, right? stuff, et cetera. Mm -hmm. In terms of transmission, we think they're both transmitted roughly the same way. That's why we're telling everyone to do the same things. Right. That's why respiratory droplets, someone with the virus coughs or sneezes, those virus droplets kind of spew out, land on a surface that we touch, and then touch our and face and get it, surface, or yeah. those virus particles land on our sort of mucous membranes, as we say, and that's how we get infected. It's one of the reasons why we say, if you see someone who's sick, really kind of keep your distance about six feet. That's mm -hmm. very, very important. So it's transmitted the same, which is why our, our recommendations are roughly the same for both. Wash your hands, mm. 20 seconds scrubbing, soap and water, alcohol, hand sanitizer. Make sure you stay home if you're sick. Avoid other people who are sick, things of that nature. Makes sense. All right, Dr. Okay. Trottle, we appreciate Thank it. You. Thank, Thank you very much.